And here we are in the THP Tech Studio. Uh, done a little bit of renovation work. Actually, underneath me here is a brand new Monster Mats 5x5. Uh, we've moved our traditional mat out of the way, which has an interesting uh, pre-built underneath system to it. I called it the other carriage. I got laughed at. So here we are uh, on this Monster Mat now, and actually it is a one-piece unit. Uh, I can tell you right now, for those of you at home who are looking for an at-home option, this was much easier to move around. Um, I've, I've experienced hitting mats in the past. I have one at my house, which actually stopped me from hitting uh, because I just didn't like it. Way too much sinkage. So the actual first thing I did with the monster mat was I stood onto it. Uh, and not surprising to me considering they do have some pretty awesome uh, commercial options. Uh, you might see these uh, around golf courses. This is actually a fairly stable unit. I stand on it. There's a subtle prints that are maybe an eighth of an inch down. And I think that has more to do with the grass material than the underbody, which is, you know, obviously substantial and enough to support weight. So I think we should hit a couple and just see what the experience is like. I mean, everyone's experienced a hitting mat, but you know, do you have something like this? That, uh, that you've hit from before. Okay, first one out of the gate. The club really travels hard through the turf. Uh, there is a little bit of leftover on the top of the club you'll find, easy to wipe off, no issues at all, absolutely no damage to the club. One of the things I find really interesting as I hit that first shot a little bit heavier than I would want to, is I actually got some interesting feedback on the mat itself. And I'm gonna just try something out here as we hit. I'm gonna push all the material in one direction and see if I can actually get a little bit of a learn on my path. Uh, this could be an actual thing. So let me hit another and see what it's like. Okay, yeah, there is a little bit of a feedback going on here. I like that. There's the the, the ground obviously pushes in one direction and if you hit a number of times you'll actually be able to see that style of uh, divot you're taking where that directional is you can work on that a little bit i'm gonna hit one more here and offer some feedback on the experience through the turf again i give it a nice little pound i get a good idea that there's enough under to support me but not super cushy Yeah, that's great. Not only the result, but uh, here on the mat as well. I'll be totally honest with you. I have low expectations for hitting mats that are in that lower end price point, not getting up into that uh, super expensive profile. I'm really impressed with this product. The pricing that's aligned with it is actually quite nice. Uh, and this is the kind of mat that I would use at my house, uh, a place that I have cars, that I need to move out of the way uh, before I go hitting. So I, I'd love for you to go try this for yourself or get some experience, uh, or at least take a look at the website and see what you think about it. Be surprised at the price as I am. Uh, and let us know in the comments if you've ever experienced these for yourselves.